Caitlin, you and I both know how indecisive you can be at times. You simply do not like to make decisions. But if there's one decision in your life that I'm glad you made, it was the day you decided to message me first, which you still brag about to this day. There's an infinite number of things I love about you. I love your laugh, your smile, your caring nature, and you get just as excited for queso as I do. I can't imagine where I'd be without you, and I cannot wait to continue this crazy journey with, journey with you by my side. Hello everyone. I'm so happy to see you here tonight for this beautiful wedding. This day has been long awaited. For those of you who don't know me, I'm Caitlin Spig. We met her freshman year of college when she decided to join our sorority. When you go through the big and little process, you get to spend time together and decide who you want to be your big and little. It is meant to be a role that is there for guidance, love, advice, and a best friend forever. Over the years, we've been there for each other through life's ups and downs, big moments, memories, and fun. I remember when she finally told me about Matt. When she started talking about him, she lit up. She said all the warm and fuzzies, she exuded nothing but happiness and love. If, if, you've, if you've known Matt for any long period of time, I mean, look at how he looks right now. That's exactly how he looked seven years ago. <laughs> So I can count the number of chin hairs that I have, and this lumberjack-looking man comes and tells me that my name is not my name. And uh, here I thought he and his beard were like foundational to building the ice rink. So I'm pretty sure I just nodded, and I was like, you got it. <laughs> Kaylin, you probably know Matt better than anybody at this point. Uh, but just in case, I'll let you know what you're in for. He's the kind of guy that's going to drive your house at 4 a.m. and pick you up to drive four hours to a different state to teach you how to snowboard all day long. Never complain about it because he's just happy to be there. Matt's the kind of guy that's going to go all in on your stupid ass idea with you just because he sees how passionate you are about it, even though he knows it's not going to end well. Matt's the kind of guy that you're going to want to spend your 4th of July's with, go to summer concerts with, explore different countries with, plan trips that are never, never actually happen. And uh, if you don't know all that by now, I'm sure you will figure it out because, uh, I know I did. I vow to always protect you from harm, to stand with you against your trouble, and to be ahead of you in your trials. You're the strongest person I know. You inspire me, you teach me, support me, and excite me. Matt, I prayed and prayed I would find someone as loving and kind as you. You are more than I ever could have imagined I would find for myself. Your love is pure and sweet, and I can feel how much you love me with the words you say, the actions you take, and the touch you give. I am in awe of your love and thankful every day. From this day forward, I give you my heart my hand, my kiss, and most importantly, my love, always and forever. Today, I become your wife, finally. <laughs> it is my honor to pronounce you to be officially married. You may now kiss the bride. <laughs>
Katie and Matt. It is rare to find two people who have a love as strong as yours. You two not only have a beautiful relationship, but a beautiful, beautiful friendship as well. And I cannot wait to see you guys love grow over the next 50 years. 